What's up everybody? It's me Lumbi from Lumbi True Stories and today Today I have yet another story for you guys another video for you to watch this story comes from bubble bus It's called the stalker. So let's just jump into it. I was 16 and Me and my friends. I'll call them Evan and shake Wanted to rent a hotel for the night since it was spring break We got to the hotel and checked in it had a really funky smell to it But we still stayed there once we got our room, it, it was about 3 p.m. So we decided to go swimming. The pool was downstairs, departed from the hotel. Once we got to the entrance, there was a man, at least six foot three, in all black, with a hood covering his face facing us. I panicked a little bit, but not out loud. We got into the pool and swam for a few hours until we saw that man again, all black, sitting on a chair by the pool. I cleared my throat. <clears throat> Can I help you, sir? I asked. No response. I still was a little paranoid. I put my face in the water, and at the bottom of the pool was another figure that was all black. I screamed like a little girl and ran for the door. I looked back and saw nothing. Not the guy in the chair, or the guy under the pool. My friends thought that I was just seeing things. But I saw what I saw as clear as day. I didn't feel like swimming anymore, so I decided to go get dinner at a nearby restaurant. I got a table for me and my friends to sit, and there I saw once again the man in all black on the other side of the dining room and was staring at me. I had had enough of this. I went over there and I lost track of him. He took off. And after that, I decided this trip has gone too far. And we should leave tomorrow morning, but my friends didn't like that idea. Once it was 10.30, me and my friends dozed off in the hotel room. I woke up to some noises. I saw a shadow of a figure at the end of the bed. I calmed myself down and told myself that it was my hat that I put there before. I went to bed. I calmed myself down and I told myself it was just the hat that I had put there before so I went to bed again and woke up about 30 minutes later to more noises I was getting thirsty so I went to grab some water but I grabbed something and I was totally shocked of what I had grabbed it was my hat I was not ever more scared in my life I couldn't help but scream at the top of my lungs. When I had heard a voice next to my ear saying, you're a I jumped out of the bed and realized it was two men in black. Right there, I tried to fight them, but it was no use once they grabbed me and dragged me out of the room. I tried to scream, but that guy was covering my mouth. I passed out and woken up in a stretcher. It turns out those guys knifed me while I passed out and someone caught them, but the doctor said no one could catch the guys who got me. To this day, I always have a night light at night so I'm not scared. So guys, what do you guys think about the story? This one is kind of different. This one is not unnatural or something. So the guy just was on his hotel room. He passed out and he was knifed. The doctor said they couldn't find the guys who got him. So what do you guys think happened? Let me know in the comments below and don't forget to like and subscribe and turn on the notification bell. Thank you so much for watching. Until the next video.